Hey guys, this is Nick Gray from Fandroid, and today I'm going to show you how to pull over all the notifications from your Android smartphone right over to your desktop computer. If you spend a lot of time sitting at a computer, there's a simple way to get your smartphone notifications pushed to your computer so that you don't have to constantly pick up your phone and check for notifications throughout the day. To do this, install Pushbullet on your Android smartphone or computer. There's a dedicated app for Windows, but you can also opt for a browser extension if you don't have a Windows PC or if your computer is locked down by your employer. Once you have set up an account and walked through the basic setup process on your phone, you'll then be able to receive notifications from your phone directly on your computer. Since not all notifications are important, we highly suggest tweaking which app notifications are pushed out by Pushbullet. The app also allows you to send and receive text messages from your computer. Tap the SMS tab within Pushbullet on your computer and you can view your text message conversations, reply to the ones that you've already received, or send out a new message to your contacts. If you've ever emailed a file or message to yourself to get something from your phone to your computer, or vice versa, Pushbullet can help with that as well. The app allows you to share files or messages between devices, and there's even a remote file feature which allows you to browse your computer files and then pull them to your mobile device. Naturally, the free version of Pushbullet does have a few limitations. If you want to send more than 100 text messages per month or share files that are larger than 25 megabytes, you will need to pony up for Pushbullet Pro, which starts at $333 per month. Pushbullet isn't as comprehensive as continuity for iOS and Mac computers, but the app does a great job of getting your Android notifications from your smartphone to your computer and allowing the two devices to work together to share files and send text messages. As always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and be sure to give the video a thumbs up.